Hello everybody, welcome back to the Wade Farms YouTube video. Today, we're going to be reviewing the Grand Scavenger. So, um, see that towing hitch? See these uh, kind of off-road tires and snorkel? You already know. You know what's first? Is me shifting. Why can't it? I can't shift into drive. Hello? My A button is broken on my controller. <laughs> Seriously? Come on. Hold on, we'll be right back. I gotta, I gotta see what's wrong with my controller. All right, it works. So, first of all, we do our testing. Oh, we got Posse even. It's by far the best car in this game. Okay, so she's not really about the whole neutral dropping, uh, you know, rocking horses type of thing. You know, she can do it, but it's not that good. Um, what we really gotta do is we gotta take it to our off-roading spot. Do some off-roading, but we gotta have fun on the way. We'll just pop some curbs, uh, slam it in reverse to stop, maybe, maybe we'll drive backwards. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll drive backwards. We're just getting into the aggressive off-roading right away. I know this is going to be kind of a shorter video. I'm sorry for you guys, but more videos are coming soon. Ooh, do we curb it? Do we curb it? We do. No damage, so we're fine. Dang, this thing might be four-wheel drive. Do we need those things? Nah, it wasn't meant to be. Okay, so... This is some pretty, this is some pretty aggressive off-roading. So I do also want to test the water ability on, or the snorkel on this thing. So as you can see, is that duct tape? It's probably duct tape. Um, so yeah. <laughs> duct tape, that's crazy. Okay, I also want to test tone with this thing too. We'll just put this thing through the paces. We're doing the rough off-roading first because I know this car is going to get destroyed. Will it fit? Dang. Why is this car doing surprisingly well? Here's where she doesn't do well. Maybe. We'll just gas through it. There we go. Wow. I've took other cars through that, and I've actually kind of tried a little bit, and they did not do as good as this. Um, I don't know if I can say it, but Crown Victoria. The Ford Crown Victoria. That's basically what this is. Um... So first obstacle, this is why we get good suspension in something like this. Let me see if I can lift it real quick, just a quick little modification. Alright everybody, we're back. <laughs> and watch this. <laughs> okay, that's, that's pretty cool. Alright, so we should be able to go over some of this stuff better. I could have put better tires on, but I just wanted you know, the best. Ooh, it's bouncy. That's one of the best off-roading we could get, you know. Ooh, we're just bouncing. Ooh. She's not doing bad. A little beat up. She's a little rowdy. I'll have to lower it. Just a little bit. Uh oh, wait, never mind. Just drop it down. Just, just a little bit. A little too high. Oh, wait, that's probably standard. No. Is that. Okay, that's probably good. So it's not as bouncy, a better ride. Dang. Dude, this thing's gonna go all the way through it. It's crazy. I mean, the hydraulic suspension was definitely nice, but it's a little bouncy. Ooh, 
go, 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 go. Okay, we're good, we're good. Wait, interior view? Uh oh, I'm scared. <laughs> I can't do interior view for this. The problem is it's not four-wheel drive, no. Uh oh. You gotta be kidding me. Is, what, is our rim bent? Look, if we need the... <laughs> okay, um... Little, little assistance. Come on. Okay, it, it... I have to assist it. Hold on. Come on, Crown Vic. Uh-oh. No! Okay, well, you know what we could do? Test its ability in the water. <laughs> All right, let's see, what she, see what she got. Oh, the snorkel is just completely broken. Like, it should work here. Wow. This is horrible. You have your family car, I guess? Yes, yeah, it's definitely a family car. What do you do with the family? Well, you used to go camping, even though there's no seats for anybody else. I guess they get to ride in the camper. That'd be fun. So, um, yeah, I guess the next step is uh, towing. So, let's see how it does. This is towing, I think it's like 3,000 pounds. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to raise up the rear to help us out a little bit. Okay. <laughs> I don't know why it took a long time, but it's riding level now, so. Engine power isn't bad. We got a tire in our hood. Can brake good enough. It's not bad. Like, it's really doing pretty well. Uh, trailers... Is it... It's right level, right? Yeah, it's right good enough. Oh, well. I guess we'll just... Tow it around. I mean, this might... This might replace my truck. I mean, it's doing pretty well. <laughs> 40 mile per hour. No mercy reversey. While towing a trailer. Which I don't know if that would help it. But... I don't, want, I don't want it to be. I don't think that's full. That's better. That looks at least kind of normal now. Plus we got a little bit of bounce to it now. Okay. Not bad. Just drifting around. We flipped it. That's not good. All right, so pass the towing test. Towed pretty well. Tow in a pinch if you needed to. All right, so it's gonna be a surprise for test number three. You'll find out very, very soon. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna actually slam her in reverse and do no mercy reversal. Turn around. Okay, so rear crash test, did all right. What happens when you hit a camper going on about Ah, I'd say 60. We missed it. How do we manage to do that? Okay, looks like we gotta whip this thing around again. Okay, so what happens when you front end? A, uh, how do you, I don't know. I don't know, at 60. What happens when you hit a camper at 70? back up and look at it here. <laughs> the 
<laughs> the trailer is stuck to the car. Okay. Um. Not really what I was looking for. Hold on. Come on. Come on. I know you want to. Just get off of it. Come on. Come on. So is your family safe? Well, it's just you. So your family's not riding with you, and your Blair bags didn't go off. So it's just a minor accident. It should still work. I'm it's just ill buff, ill buff. Um, you don't have a radiator, which you might want to get that fixed. And um, your suspension. Well, it still works. It looks normal now, basically, right? Steering's off a little bit. You can't really see too well, so when it comes to driving, it's probably not the best. Oh, we're on the sidewalk, and we hit another building. Okay, well, you might be dead here, <laughs> but does it still drive? No. No, the engine's done. <laughs> no. All right, well, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you guys like, subscribe, and hit the bell for post notifications, and we'll catch you guys next time. But you fine.